Hi, my name is Nikki and I'm with dynamic-crm.com and I'm happy to show you one of our videos titled Set Pick List Based on Other Pick List. This is one of many tutorials included on our site for our product called the Script Generator. In addition to learning how to run multiple scripts in the Script Generator, our site also provides video how-to blogs that give instructions for how to make various customizations in Microsoft Dynamic CRM. So in today's example, uh, this video is going to show you what the set pick list based on other pick list script looks like when it's applied to Microsoft Dynamics CRM. So what we want to do is we're going to open a new account and we're going to apply this script to the general tab and the two fields that we're going to apply it to are the shipping method pick list and the freight terms pick list. And what we're going to do is tell the script generator to if we select will call as a shipping method then we want this freight terms to automatically default to no charge and that's just what we'll do so we're going to pull up our script generator we're already logged in and we're going to select the set pick list based on other pick list script and hit continue and as you can see over here to the right it gives you a definition um, depending on what you have selected over here on the left for your script so it's loading the entity form and once it does that we'll go to the next screen where we're going to select our here we go our target form and we said we're going to apply it to the account form so we hit select and right now it's determining the available form values associated with that form and when it's finished doing that it's going to populate these two areas with our um, fields that we can apply the script to and it should be finished any minute now okay so we said what we're going to do is we are going to select the freight terms and then we're going to select no charge because that's what we're going to ask it to default to. We'll hit continue and now we need to select the shipping method and we want to select will call because we said that we want uh, if we select will call then we want it to default to no charge which is what we selected in the screen previous. So we'll hit continue and now as you can see the script generator is preparing the script. Once it's finished preparing the script then it will then save the script and a pop-up box will uh, notify you that the customization has been added and that the account entity has been published. So now it's saving the script. Okay so the customization has been successfully added and it's been published. We hit OK. Minimize our scripts generator and now when you go to new record we need a fresh record or just make sure you close out of any old forms. Now let me move this over a little bit. Whenever you go over to shipping method and you select will call as you can see freight terms automatically default to no charge and that's basically it. So thank you for your time in watching this video. Please visit our website dynamic-crm.com to learn about all 20 scripts included in the scripts generator. You can see if you go to our tutorials tab we have a product tour that you can take uh, to see all of the functionality and just get an overall idea of what's included in the scripts generator product. Um, you can see tutorials for each script in video format or screenshots and additionally you can visit our blog and just to see um, or find instructions on how to make various customizations in Microsoft Dynamics CRM. If you have a customization question that we don't answer, go to our Contact Us form, select Blog Suggestion, provide us with your information, type in your question, submit it to us, and we shall do our very best to find the answer and then publish that to our blog. Um, so that's it, and thank you again.